he's lying and he's been lying for so long. And it is difficult for me to see him and to hear his voice. Allen says the alleged assaults never happened, a denial that he has made for years. But this time, Hollywood is grappling with an industry-wide movement against sexual misconduct. Eli Glasner has the details. I uh, was taken to a small attic crawl space in uh, my mother's uh, country house in Connecticut. Then Dylan Farrow says her adoptive father, Woody Allen, asked her to lie down. And as I played with the toy train, I was sexually assaulted. As a seven-year-old, I would say, I would have said he touched my private parts. Mm -hmm. Farrow says she wanted to add her voice to the public conversation around sexual assault. A statement released by Woody Allen frames his daughter's motives differently, saying, The Farrow family is cynically using the opportunity afforded by the Time's Up movement to repeat this discredited allegation. That doesn't make it any more true today than it was in the past. This biographer says actors and critics are also jumping on the Me Too Time's Up bandwagon. To me, it's a mixture of uh, uh, idealism and opportunism and hypocrisy. Uh, they're mainly people who uh, don't really know the history of the case. This is a 25-year-old custody battle. I want to talk. Oh, no. I want Alan explored I relationships between older men and young ingenues in many of his films. I care about you. Your concerns are my concerns. We have great sex. You, you're, but you're 17 years old. Um, in the past, some admirers were able to separate the artist from the art. No longer, says this writer. Why do I have to suspend my judgment just because this guy is making art? And more to the point, why is this horrible person allowed to continue making art? Isn't that part of the problem? At the time of the alleged abuse, Dylan Farrell was caught in the middle of a bitter custody battle between Allen and his then-partner, Mia Farrow. Allen was investigated by two separate state agencies, but never charged. But those in the industry say Allen will have trouble making more movies. I think it's going to be very difficult. You know, it's possible he'll find money somewhere to do what he does, or someone will help him find money. I just don't know that he's going to exist in the mainstream Hollywood. While those who know him say Allen will keep working, his time in the spotlight may be up. Eli Glasner, CBC News, Toronto.